Hello, welcome to Setting Scoliosis Stray Foundation. In this video, we will focus on how to prepare for school before and after scoliosis surgery. Before surgery, there are many things that you can do to prepare for missed time at school. We also have a few tips to help you for returning back to school. Let's begin with the list of things we recommend you do before surgery. One, it can be helpful to schedule your surgery around an existing school break so you will miss less school work. Two, contact your school principal and counselor a few months prior to your surgery to begin the process of preparing for an extended school absence. Three, some school districts have home and hospital instruction program. You may be able to have credentialed teacher come to your home for tutoring so you can stay current on homework, quizzes, and tests whenever possible. Four, even if you have a coordinated home and hospital instruction program, talk to your teacher ahead of time about your plans to make up missed school work. You might have the option to work ahead prior to surgery so you won't fall too far behind. Five, contact your school nurse and fill out appropriate paperwork to allow you to take medication during the school day in the event that you are still using medication when you return to school. Six, Collect phone numbers or email address of at least one person from each of your class before surgery so you can reach out with questions about your assignments. Seven, request a second set of books to keep at home since you won't be able to carry a heavy backpack for three months after surgery. You can take notes on paper at school and then transfer them to your notebook at home so you aren't carrying too much during the day. You will have to use a small tote bag or other type of bag instead of a backpack. If you are in extracurricular activity and need to have equipment, an instrument, etc. with you throughout the week, recruit a friend who can carry those items for you. 8. Missed class work can feel overwhelming to make up. Two weeks post-surgery is a good time to start doing a little work each day, but this timeline is different for everyone. As soon as you feel up to tackling your makeup work, it can be helpful to create a list of all assignments you need to complete and check each item off when completed to help you stay organized. Make a checklist can help you prioritize what you want to get done each day. And checking items off as you go will help you pace yourself and gain momentum from seeing your accomplishment. Nine, you might want to consider going back to school for half day at first and then eventually going back for full days. This can make the transition easier since going back to school after surgery can be tiring. 10, even if you feel ready to go back to school, consider taking an extra week off to catch up on all the work you missed and give yourself a little extra time to recover. It can feel less overwhelming to head back to school when you have caught up on the majority of your work, especially if you're in high school. 11, to increase your stamina for long school days, practice sitting in the kitchen or dining chair for a long period of time in days leading up to your return to school. We hope you find this information helpful and feel more comfortable about taking time off school and more prepared to return to school after your recovery period. If you like more helpful tips like this, visit our website at www.settingscoliosisstraight.org and download a free digital copy of our Spinal Fusion Surgery. Helpful tips for patients and caregivers today. If you would like to support this channel, please give us a like and remember to subscribe to our channel today. Thank you.